this is a 1500 rupee wireless earphone and it sounds amazing so let's begin what's up guys i'm suman from phone steen and in today's video we will take a look at the leaf flex now this definitely came few you know few months back but i got the chance to test it out right now and i think this is really underrated now people definitely go with uh, companies like oppo or oneplus when it comes to wireless earphones nothing wrong those are really good earphones but this year is really underrated but the audio the sound quality is amazing on these pairs of earphone and especially for the price these are great value so in this video i'll start off with the audio quality because that was one thing which immediately impressed me and i was like wow. now let's make things simple here and not technical because i'm no audio expert and this review comes from the perspective of a average earphone user so this makes this review as practical as it can be so if you're someone who watches a lot of movies or listens to a lot of songs then the leaf flex is an ideal earphone for you now if you're watching a movie so be it action horror or any genre the sound stage is really clean and powerful in simple terms you get the sense of being in a theater and uh, i'm not joking so please try it out for yourself if your friends have uh, one of these earphones definitely try it for yourself and uh, i'm not joking so i'm serious about that anyways uh, it doesn't have dolby support or anything fancy but there is definitely a noticeable amount of immersive sound which makes it even more ideal for action and sci-fi movies now you guys might not know but i'm a person who prefers you know flatter sound stages i don't like too much of bass but this earphone definitely changed that but no i'm not going to go out and buy earphones with big uh, heavy bass but still you know this earphone was you know very pleasing to listen to so i watched a lot of movies on this just for the purpose of uh, testing this to its limits and i watched movies like you know avengers and uh, captain america and i have to say the experience was really good on this even listening to music was a delight now i'm not a huge fan of uh, western music and i always prefer indian music especially the little older ones you know which have all these indian instruments in them and surprisingly these earphones performed well on indian instruments itself so like uh, there was no bass for an instrument which actually didn't produce bass because some earphones tend to do that and uh, here that was not the case indian instruments or indian music was a delight to listen on this But for the sake of this uh, review I did listen to some of my old favorite western songs you know from Backstreet Boys Eminem and Kanan like the old songs and I have to say it was an enjoyable experience The Leaf Flex definitely has some bass to it but it is not overpowering So usually when there's a lot of bass in an earphone sometimes the vocals or the dialogues tend to get buried under that bass and the experience is very bad you won't be able to listen to the dialogues especially if it's an action scene you won't be able to listen and if it's a, a song with you know pumping energy all you could be able to hear is the bass and not the vocals so that is not the case here it is actually good so in simple terms i think there's a perfect balance between everything in this earphone now i'm not saying these are the best earphones in the market no there are many other from many other companies but you can consider this as one of the best options you can go for finally on the topic of audio i had no issues with calls and the person on the other end could hear me properly so calls are actually good on these anyways there's a new app from leaf to control your products and i'll definitely be covering a lot on that app in an upcoming video but in short the app was clean with some nice features but i'll have to test it out even more so stay tuned for that now talking about the design and comfort of these earphones these are a pretty light pair of earphones the flex is made up of rubber and plastic which is surprisingly light and flexible the portion which sits around your neck is really comfortable and also symmetrical and that makes it really ideal for people like me who have ocd anyways the ear tips were nice i had no issues with the comfort even after uh, long use but make sure you use the right ear tip size the earbuds are magnetic and those magnets are really really strong 
but I couldn't find features like auto pause when the earbuds are attached together that other earphones actually offer. You know, it would have been a really useful feature because you wouldn't need to use the controls on the earphone itself each and every time to, you know, pause or play your music. And on the topic of controls, those are on the right hand side. And the buttons are really clicky, but you might take some time to get used to it because the markings on them aren't that well defined. So in simple words, you know, they are not raised from those uh, buttons themselves, which makes it kind of hard to locate which one is which. So sometimes you might end up clicking the wrong one. So, but as time goes by, you will definitely get used to it. Now with the controls, uh, you can also access voice assistant and uh, that's great. Now below those controls is your charging port and it's micro USB. I really wish it was USB-C cause you could have carried only one cable around with you to charge everything you have. Now since we are talking about charging, let's talk about the battery life. So the Leaf uh, Flex here has remarkable standby time. So even if you keep the Leaf Flex on full charge for a week and go, when you come back after a week, there'll still be enough charge for you to use that earphone for say around one or two days without any issues. So that's how good the standby time is. But if you're someone who regularly uses their earphones, say like on average for two hours a day, you could easily use this earphone for three days. Or if you try to push it more with light use, you can use it even for four days without any problem. So in simple terms, the battery life on the Leaf Flex is pretty solid. But I just hope, you know, uh, Leaf would uh, swap the micro USB for USB-C, you know, which would make it more convenient for the end user. And uh, last but not least, the range is decent here. It's not the best because if I have my phone in one room and go to a nearby room, the connection gets kind of bad. But in an open area, it is fine. Say like even after 15 feet, the connection was strong. So decent, but not the best. Anyways, we've come to the end of this video. And I have to say, the Leaf Flex is a pretty solid pair of earphones for anyone who wants a wireless earphone that will deliver great audio at an affordable price. Watching movies with this was a delight and I'll go as far as telling that this is one of the best for media consumption. It has pretty good battery life, the build is light and I couldn't find any other major flaw here and that makes this an ideal pair of wireless earphones for many. So as of making this video, the Leaf Flex on Amazon is priced at 1500 rupees. So it usually goes for 2000 rupees, but uh, make sure you check the links in the description for the most updated pricing. So 1500 or beat even 2000 rupees. For 2000 rupees, I still think this is a really good earphone that you should consider buying. Now, if you have many other uh, earphones in your wish list, please do add this. And if you get a chance to try it out, definitely do because these are genuinely a really good pair of earphones. I've used Leaf before and this is one of my favorite products from Leaf. So make sure you check out the Leaf Flex. The links are in the description. Anyways, thanks for watching. And this here is Suman signing off once again. Catch you later.